those of you that have been with me before in a coin show know the Silver Eagle, love the series. The fact that they have unks, proofs, and now satins every year, love it even more. But every year without fail, one of them is always the most limited. And that is that burnished satin finish. And tonight we have it on steroids. I have the lowest and the one with the lowest population in 70. Which means it's the rarest Silver Eagle of the year. And if you look at all the satin finish Silver Eagles, the burnished Silver Eagles, the special W mint mark Silver Eagles we'll show you here in a minute. From 2006 through last year's 2022, the one with the most limited number of 70s, the lowest number of 70s is 2013. You are looking at it. Now, burnished and or sandblast, if you look at the surface here, you can just tell it's not a normal uncirculated. They kind of give it a sandblast. Uh, Allison explained this a number of shows ago, and I love the analogy, but when you're painting your house, you have flat, then you have glossy, right? You have regular, and then you have the proof. And then you have this semi in the middle, this matte finish. That's kind of the same concept when you relate it to paint, if you relate it to the concept of what they're doing to the dyes before they strike the coin. If you put them next to each other, you can tell the difference, obviously. But for these, the easiest part is the double U mint mark is on the reverse of every single coin. But let me go back to the good part, the most important part. And that is, we talk all the time about the rarest coin of the year being the burnished. This year, 2013, a decade ago, they made 42.6 million uncirculated coins. So uh, one of their better years, their top five for production. They made just under a million proofs, 934,000. But they only made 221,981 of these beautiful W mint mark, uncirculated, burnished, or satin. Now, with that said, let's go to NGC's website. They publish something known as a population report. It lets you know every coin they see all the time. No matter if it's a large cent or a silver eagle, every coin they certify, and whatever the grade is, they publish it so we know what's going on. If you look at from 06 all the way to the present, which is 2022, you're gonna find one unique statement, and that is the fact that everybody would have guessed 2012 was the year with the lowest, the fewest number of 70s known to exist. Uh-uh, it's the 2013. And it's not by like four coins. It's closer to 350 coins, different. Yet the 2012 in 70 sells for $100 more. This one's rarer, it is rarer. There are fewer of them, period. Again, the most limited 70 in the proof silver eagle is what? The 95W. Nobody argues anymore that the 19S enhanced reverse proof, they made 30,000 versus the 32,500 of the 95W. We go on the fact that it, they're both rare, but which one has fewer 70s? And which one's affordable? The 95W, there's under 1,000 in 70, and it sells for 25,000. And the S enhanced reverse proof from 19 there's about 10,000 in 70, and it sells for about 4,000. This one, significantly fewer. There are only 14,752 coins from 2013. Out of that 20, 221,000, that made 70. That is the whole story here. It is the best of the best, and now with all the data in front of us a decade later, we can look at it. And the average isn't even close. This is 14.7, 14,700. The last two or three years were way over 20 on a regular basis. And the average is over 20 when you take the average of all the coins going back to 2006 when they introduced this for the first time, this type of W mint mark in the Silver Eagle area. So it's one of my favorite categories because it's that hidden gem and it's hidden in plain sight, but it doesn't need to be. Every year they release three, and they have been since 2006. The Unk, which comes out in January, the Proof a little while after that, and the last coin released, usually summer into fall, is the Satin Finish or Burnished, you're seeing right here. The W mint mark uncirculated. If, you see a, if it's not a Proof and you see a W on it, you know it's a Burnished. 
but the lowest mintage every year. And now when we're looking at these numbers, are you ready? A 2013 West Point proof in 70, which has 25,000 more coins certified, sells for about $250. Can anyone explain that to me? Popularity is with the proof all the time. We always talk about that. We know that. And popularity has a very important part with all collectibles. But rarity, just like with real estate, location, 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 quality, 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 the rarity, rarity, rarity is the name of the game in Silver Eagles. And almost any other collectible for that matter. It's the lowest mintage, it's the lowest population, it's the highest grade, and tonight it's the craziest price. Our competition have the 2013 you're looking at right here. In the original government packaging, which is a little display box with certificate of authenticity for $199. We're selling you a perfect 70, which is the 14,752 out of the 221,981. Isn't that crazy? I love it. I know you do as well. Our phones are very busy right now. AVCCoins.com is always the place to join us when the phones get a little bit backed up. It's about 20 seconds right now, 25 seconds. It's been bouncing back and forth the last couple of minutes. And it should. I mean, silver eagles are that number one category. It's the number one silver dollar in the world today, and nothing else even comes close. But when you can break it down, understand you know, these have been out there since 1986. There's been unks, there's been proofs, there's been satins since 2006. And if you can break it down to the lowest proof, the lowest unk, and now the rarest of the rare, which is the burnished, and the lowest of that, and then the rarest of that, and this is what you get. Guys, we've got to put a one-minute clock up. I'm down to less than 10 left. If you're visiting us via the web, that just means... I recommend strongly you push it through your shopping cart. When it gives you an order number, it means the order is locked here. Just pick up the phone, call us back later. We can entice you with anything else. We'll add to your order. I don't want anybody missing out because look at our price tonight, $179.95. And again, since 2006, they've been making three silver eagles every year. An onk, the bullion coin, a proof, and then the burnished or satin finish, which you can tell by looking at it right here, just a different look and feel. Every year it's the lowest minted, and now we're talking about, with that said, all of them that have been certified in 70 since 2006, all published on NGC's website. And this one is the one that has the lowest number of 70s known to exist. That makes it a gem. And again, my competition sells the OGP, the regular coin in a capsule for $199. They sell the proof for $250, and that coin has 25,000 more of them known to exist today. This one is a steal. And tonight, only $179.95 while they last.